Hey everybody, so welcome to my welcome back haul. <laughs> so first things first, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I got for the minimal giveaway um, from Cloth and Paper. As you guys know, my favorite go-to um, pouch <laughs> is this one from Cloth and Paper. And I originally got mine from the sub box, but I got you guys one too. So whoever wins this giveaway is gonna win a few things um so I'll open this all right so i'm gonna keep this box here because i honestly completely forgot how i used to film <laughs> so this is kind of helping prop up my uh, broken tripod now so this is cloth and paper all right so first I got a second Angora grab sticky notes for myself because I really love these sticky notes. So I have a backup. I got a winner of oh, my favorite sticky notes. It is Palette Volume 5 and they are circle sticky notes. They are amazing. I love these so much and they are the Angora color as well. They are kind of a beige color. I got myself a backup. <laughs> uh, the winner will also get one of the Angora transparent sticky notes. Um, they're very different. Um, sometimes the colors vary with cloth and the paper versus the matte version and the transparent. And I got one for myself. I got a winner, a Prosecco sticky note, the memo. Super cute. I got myself an extra. <laughs> And the winner will be getting a clear pouch, just like the one I have. Um, actually, I think this one's slightly different. These, um, the buttons on mine are white, and then these are clear. And then I got myself a second one because it's starting to bug me that the white little buttons are kind of getting scratched up. So I really love these pouches, and I know I can use them for many, many reasons. So yeah. Okay. On to the next piece here, second little package. Um, so I got the bundle. So I got the bundle comes with this, the Angora sticky notes, the transparent ones, the Angora square page flags, and then the regular page flags, and as well as a uni pen. So I'll come with one of these for the giveaway. This is a piece of the giveaway. I thought it'd be a good idea too if you're looking at this and thinking about entering my giveaway that's going to be on my instagram um also adding in these things right here oh don't fall so i have two samples of my favorite pet tapes here um it is from freckles freckles tea and then another one is from hartley paper this is one of my favorite ones so you get two samples of those. Those are technically just freebies. And then a card from Rose and Tea. It was one of my favorite cards. Um, don't know why this is here. <laughs> and then a Peach Palm Transparent Hexagon. Dusk Cloth and Paper Page Flag. My all-time... This is how you I this is how I show my appreciation to you guys. These are my favorite clouds colors from High Paper Clouds. These were customs um blush and fog. So these came in one of the first sub boxes I got from High Paper Clouds and then I asked for uh customize. So give me you guys a full sheet of each of those. A ash page flag. Uh, oh, I showed you guys this one, but this is the one I was going to give. <laughs> a Chingona clear card from uh, Mom Plans XOXO. Some of my favorite washi samples. Another freebie. All-time favorite sticky note too from Infinite Lotus. And that's it for the minimal. So I thought it was just fun. I'm going to put them all in here. Send that to a lovely winner uh, whenever I can figure out how to do that because I have never given a, done a giveaway. <laughs> so yeah, I'm so excited for that. It's like literally everything I love in one little package. So 
I am so excited for one of you guys to win that. I'll package that super cute. So yeah, that's it from Coffin Paper. I got some freebies here. Um, yeah, I got myself my own little Angora. Um, this is I really love this color too. Angora bundle for myself. All right, that's it. Let's keep this in the back. These are really cute. I love to um, put some of that pet tape, which is why I want to give it a give some away so you guys can try that if you guys have seen my uh bookmarks on my instagram it's one of my favorite things to do you know a little crafty time little crafty sesh with yourself um or by yourself it's super fun to me so i thought it was a great uh addition to the giveaway and i love to also uh journal on these type of cards for example i just did this one a long ago i think it's just really cute <laughs> i think the combo of the very minimal cards from cloth and paper and then the pet tapes it's just a fun way to use your pet tapes and then uh just to get crafty and then eventually you know you'll use them i use them in my pockets if i come to a colorway that's close to this or you know you can make your own for how your month is themed and all that good stuff <laughs> i completely forgot how to talk on the camera so excuse me if i lose my breath so I'll get better again. All right. So the next thing is, like I said, I'm keeping this box in the background because it's copying my phone up. Okay. So I did a Rose Color Days order. I haven't ordered from Rose Color Days in forever. It's probably been, it's been a minute. Actually, no, I ordered some stuff last year. <laughs> I ordered some clouds. All right. So I ordered just a couple uh, pieces from the last from last week oh this is a little uh tabbed freebie cute it is hollow hollow foil rose card is one of the first shops i shopped at too when i was doing deco planning love her shop freebie i'm pretty sure that's like a copper foil okay so i got two for my stology journaling or my planner I got, it was so hard, I wanted to buy like three of everything, but I'm trying to be good. <laughs> so I got a full page deco sheet in the Rustic Autumn. These colors just scream to me. I adore these colors. They are so beautiful. Like seriously, stunning. Perfection. I love it. And then I got Ghost Stories. Super cute, kind of spooky, kind of romantic a little bit. <laughs> But I really love it. I really love these um, kind of like brick swatches. Super cute. I'm so excited to try uh, use those in October, which is already literally around the corner. Crazy. Okay. In my first order from Main Street Crafts Co., I saw this shop from Ash Plans. Uh, she showed that she got like one of those little bookmarks. So I went to her shop immediately and started looking. She's going to have a restock soon. So if you guys really like what I got, uh, these are st items I think are still in her shop right now, the ones I got. But there's going to be a restock of other goodies that I saw um, in the reviews. Some people were posting the photos. So I'm excited for that. Uh, I hate ripping, like, because it's so, it's packaged so beautifully. Okay, oh man, we're going to save that. Alright, okay, so I can use that for journaling. So I have here, I got two bookmarks and then a transparent sticky note sheet. Um, Here's a freebie card, let's open this up. Looks like these are the freebies or her business card. All right, so here's a little card, super cute. I'm gonna read them this into my half letter right away. Super cute. It has um, sweater, pumpkin, and PSL. Everything fall. Stay cozy card, super cute. This is my invoice, and then a thank you letter. I love this paper. So pretty, pretty, so pretty. Okay. I'm excited. Just can't see. Okay. So she has different options of the ribbon. Um, 
you can't really like pick and choose which ribbon on every single one but I liked the white ribbon or the cream ribbon I think is what it is oh so cute okay this is the copper I was about to get the white but I'm really glad I went with the copper because it's very pumpkin-y very fall so it's a little like latte oh, I love this I love it so much and then I got a little like Polaroid and it has I think magnolia dried magnolia I think is what I read super cute super dainty very cute I love them I've been so excited to get it so then I can like you know so cute I always love how Ash plans like uh, layers her things goals I cannot do that but so cute look at that so pretty and look at those leaves you see like the little vine kind of stunning stunning I love it absolutely love this okay and then I just got one sticker sheet that she offered in her shop all things pumpkin you know me so it's just a transparent for my astrology and half letter um, and my daily journaling, my daily planning in my week's astrology. So some cream pumpkin, some latte cups, sweaters, longer pumpkins, and then some flourishes or foliage, I guess. Super pretty. I love that. So check out, check out Main Street Crafts Co. Studying at, and she peaked and uh, kind of hinted that there's going to be a restock very soon. So go check it out. All right, one more shop. So one question I get a lot um, when I post my Paper Minty Sticker Studio, like when I use them, um, I have them in an album. And because I was into deco planning, <laughs> um, I had a lot of extra stuff that I got to use and especially storage I used for... Um, my minimal stuff so that's two of the albums i use in there five by seven i believe and then i got this one from zadie stickers so it's a beautiful uh stickers with this candle thingy majiggy <laughs> so pretty i loved it and i got this on sale it is stunning so this is the large albums from uh, I bought my, these ones from Samantha May Sticks, but they're no longer in her shop. But they're exactly the same. And they will fit your Paper Minty Studio Sheets perfectly. Perfectly. So, anything that's 5 by 7 they will fit perfectly in here. You don't have to bend them. And nothing. So, they fit perfectly in here. Most of my journaling stuff, shops end up kind of be in the same size so and they fit everything fits perfectly in here journaling kits so if you're looking for albums such as this to store your journaling stuff check sadie stickers she has so many styles um also has journaling kits <laughs> if that's something you're interested in i think i have i think i actually used the ones i had from sadie stickers kind of I have some transparent ones for sure. So let's on this one. I know sometimes um, it's you don't really look at deco deco account shops because it's deco in this like the sticker kits, but I would highly recommend to always keep an eye out because they are coming out with amazing journaling kits. I mean they always have been, but oh here, some Sadie sticker kits, Sadie stickers. So check it out if you haven't yet and you're into journaling. Um, so yeah, these albums are from are perfect for Paper Menti Studio. I'm going to make a post on my Instagram just to share the awareness because I always get comments and questions about what album it is because the, paper, the one I use the most every day is what I want to put in here because I want to see it every day. <laughs> so I'm going to put all my transparents in here, which is this one.
So the next thing is um, papery planning for some minimal stickers. Okay, okay, okay. So here's the freebie, which is a fall freebie, and some glasses. I don't have any glasses icons. I just realized so like not long ago. So with her shop, you get two for um, her listings. It's two little sheets. So I just got some glasses to mark when I get new glasses or doctor appointment eye doctor appointments. Very simple. And I really like these uh, smaller cards because when it comes to um, my weeks, I know I appreciate smaller icons and I can kind of tuck them in there if I need to quickly plan on the go. And this is a fall freebie. Super cute. I love it. I love that papery planning always gives you freebies according to the season. <laughs> I really appreciate that because it's it's great. You'll use them up, you know, and then you don't always need so like you don't need too many seasonal stickers. OK, so then oh, I'm so excited. All right. So I got some of these new round squares in Cafe Misto. This is this is one of my favorite colors. So I decided to try that one first. And then uh, the Floral Deco and Transparent. They're like little swatches with florals on them. Really cute. I got the Fall Phrases. Because for dailies, I kind of like putting a little quote <laughs> in the top corner. So I think these are going to be really cute for the next few dailies. I have the 2023 Holiday Tiny Font for my weeks. Um, I have the 2022 ones, but I never ended up <laughs> using them. So... I still have the little icons at least and um, these are separate so you can um, cut use the date or use just this so I can still use the actual holidays and then I put Maria's name for her freebie and I also purchased a freebie because I have this thing that uh, I like to have the freebies <laughs> the exclusive freebies I think they're really great for um, I really love them in the week spreads so I'm saving a lot of them for when I start my weeks, but also um, I've been wanting, I've started using some in my dailies from in my Stology weeks, my Stology weeks. So I think this is going to be really cute. So one's a freebie that came with the order after placing the order, and then I purchased one. So you can purchase the freebies um, at Papery Planning. Highly recommend. They're really cute. I love them. Okay. Drum roll, please. Last. But certainly not least, not at the least, high paper cards. <laughs> I'm, I love high paper cards. Like, that's an understatement. <laughs> um, Justine's creations are always so unique and beautiful. Her colorway this year is spot on with what I love. So, uh, yeah. Okay. So, I ordered... Um, on my Instagram, but I've been using them a lot. So I got the another because I like to have extras because I'm crazy. And then I actually filled up a whole loyalty card. So I think this is that freebie for that. Yeah, pretty sure. So um, with her shop, you can get up to three loyalty cards in a year uh, once you fill them up. So I can show you guys. Oh, they look like this when they're empty. And with every order you place, you get a little cloud. So, um, I get the, her cloud boxes, I get both the minimal and the journaling. So, I quickly filled up. <laughs> so, I already turned this one in. Uh, this one's complete. And, um, this is the one I'm working on now. And, I don't know if you can tell, but I really love it. <laughs> so, September. Super cute. I love them. Um, I actually lost two of the clouds so i would have had june <laughs> so i probably would have i would have been two away from another loyalty card but it's okay um i think i accidentally threw them away all right so this is her business card um yeah so this is let's start let's open the little loyalty freebie shall we okay oops guys so excited okay so there's some um, small Oh, yeah, it says loyalty right there. I just noticed that. Uh, small clouds, and they're slightly different in color. Kind of look from far away, they look this, like the same gray. 
but they're her colorway. So pretty. Can't wait use, to use those. And then some like grid dots. This is all transparent. Some dots. Some grid black clouds. So cute. Love that. Oh, I love these squiggles. A little Polaroid, like a distress Polaroid. I don't know why I'm doing this. And then a happy face Polaroid for journaling. That is an amazing loyalty perk. You cannot tell me that is not. That is amazing. I loved everything in that. Okay, and then I have a freebie. This was the freebie going out without orders. And then I spent a good amount. So I, oh, I put um, a name for a freebie. Super cute. And then I got another freebie here. Super cute. And I kind of peeked these <laughs> when she was posting like a little behind the scenes. And I love these happy thoughts. So it was a tiered freebie. I'm glad I got that. Oh my gosh, I forgot about this. So this is the Gigi Plannery and High Paper Clouds collab. And they are the credit card um, holder envelopes holder. Like you can put little credit card size stickers in here. And um, exclusive to High Paper Clouds shop, she was going to have the gray. The gray one. So obviously I needed it. And I got it. Also got a few other colors. Um from GG Pannery. Um, I got white and taupe or light brown. They are so cute. I really love these and and I keep them in my little pouchy. <laughs> look, look, just wait. Let's let's transition, shall we? This is my flipping favorite. Are you kidding? Oh my goodness, I love it. Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. Gray is my favorite color. I don't know if you guys noticed that. <laughs> Alright, so then I got... Also, this is from a sub box. So I bought a lot of a la carte things for this order. Uh, extras, so um, shell and bouquet. This is from... Um, that box is, I think, the May box. I got some clouds. They're like little emotion clouds so cute uh just to mark a good day just for a cute deco a little happy happy smiley faces so this is the palette so i think this is the her palette for this year for her shop really cute the nude some nude um little flourishes i got some backups this is from another box um it was another favorite box i think no it's not it's not the same as this one no, this is the Maximal Minimal box, this one. And this one is the May box, I think. I really love the colors in this one, too. I really, um, the next time I'm saving up for um, probably to order more of the customized clouds. And um, I kind of want to see, I don't even know if she still does customizations. Probably when she has time only, obviously, because she's always, obviously, giving these amazing releases. So, um... I want to ask for these little grid, and they're kind of a beige color, like a full sheet of those. Aren't they cute? I love these. So, I got extra so I can use the other ones. <laughs> I have a, the Maximal Minimal. No, this is this box that just came. The August box. So pretty. So, I, um, I got this in transparent. They're the stamps. I got, oh, the little ghosts transparent paper i got some new clouds i'm so excited for these um she has a new palette so it's dust and cotton i wonder if she's going to change these next year because she is and i really like these i'm gonna have to buy more <laughs> um but these are a lot bigger than these ones so i just noticed that these ones are my favorite And then I got these I really like for um, the daily planning. I got some dates, cloud dates, uh, for my weeks specifically. So I got taupe and mauve. 
I got another little Halloween washi strips. I really like this, these colors together. Super cute. Another August a la carte um, item, and then this is transparent. August box two, and these are just little circles, really cute and transparent. The box came with matte, so I'm gonna like using those in my half letter, I'm sure. And then I got an extra sheet of these because I really like these. This is from the Maximal Minimal box. If I could have anything over and over and over, a non like ending amount, it'd be the Maximal Minimal box. And then this is Maximal Minimal. Super cute. I love this. I got two sheets of those because I know I'm going to use those up. And then this I loved using in my half letter. They're like little sketches. Dainty flourishes, super cute. And I love these girls for my stology. Um, um, the box came with matte, so I really like to have transparent. But that is it for my um, first haul in a while. Um, my first minimal haul. And I appreciate you guys <laughs> if you're watching this and coming back if you're a subscriber. I would appreciate if you are a new watcher, new viewer, to please subscribe. I would appreciate so much. Um, if you don't watch the older videos I have, um, it has always been a thing of mine that I really always wanted to start a YouTube channel. So I'm um, going to try and see what I can collaborate into this YouTube. Um, if it's going to be life things too, maybe some vlogging. So we'll see. But for now, it will be mainly... Um, all my planning things, all my planning favorites, and things like that. So, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next haul because I have more things coming in. And your girl's going on a no spend for sure <laughs> until 2023, maybe like mid-2023 because I am loaded. Completely set. <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.